Okay, so one thing that's been going around like crazy is how do I install a resource pack worlds. for iOS 13 on iOS? And I've got the perfect solution. So as you can see here, I have a shader on. I actually just found out how to do this, to be honest. And right now, look, even, even if I face this way, it's darker, lighter, darker, lighter. <laughs> it works perfectly. So I'm, so I'm going to be here to show you how to do it. And don't worry about those. Those, um, you can worry, you, you'll, you'll, you'll find out what those are later. Anyways, let's get to the video. Okay, so, what's that I used was mpdl.com. It's kind of like a good thing that, you know, so, oh, I can't speak. Anyways, so I'm just going to click on something random like a Cedar Point Camp Amusement Park. That works. So I'm going to scroll down, blah, 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 installation. Then I click, you can click, it's, it's easier to do that .zip, but I'll show you how to do .mc world. So you would click that, you click download, and then we we'll go to your download manager. And, okay, there you go, Cedar Point. Now you click on this, then when you click on this, look, you see, normally you would go here and go, to sh and go somewhere here, but... That does not work. It, I, I, I promise you, it does not work. So what you need to do is you need to go to the App Store and you need to download this app called Documents by Readle. After you do that, this is what the app looks like. I've already tried, this is the shaders right here. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna head back to Files. Now what you need to do, if you can, you gotta, you gotta try to 3D touch or just hold down our Taptic Touch. Then what you need to do is you need to go to move. And what you need to do, yeah, I'm going to get this back up and out of here. So what you do is click on on my iPhone, documents by Riedel, click copy. Then you head back to documents by Riedel. And then when you get there, what you want to go is go to iTunes files. And you see there's a Cedar Point Camp project. When you click on this, it will say unsupported. So what you need is you just need to... Go here, rename, you go past over here, you delete the MC World part, and you dot zip. Then click done, and click use as zip. After that, it changes the zip. So then you click on it one more time. Then what you need to do is click on the, uh, click on the three dots. You have to go click on share, and then you click on at save the files, and then you click on Minecraft game. Calm that mojang, and then you click on Minecraft Worlds, and then no, not world, yeah, Worlds, and you click save. All right, so I'm now back in the game, and as you can see, when I get in and click play, I got the Cedar Point. Um, okay, I got the Cedar Point, the Cedar Camp Cedar Fair Park project. Copy. So then I click play, and then once I get in, you'll see that I am perfectly in the world, and since I have the shader, I have a shader too, and now I'm in the map. So it works perfectly, look, the whole map's here, everything's here. So that's how you download a Minecraft map. So anyways, oh wait, wait, I should probably say that um, the same thing works for um, resource packs. That's how I download this thing. It's the exact same process for resource packs. So, anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, smash that like button and subscribe. And I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.